Good morning and thanks so much for watching Denver 7 Plus. I'm Jason Grenauer. We begin the top of the hour with breaking news. Police Chief Vanessa Wilson at Aurora Police is no longer the police chief. A news release coming out from the city manager just a few moments ago reads that after a considerable amount of assessment and a recognition that areas of the department need refocused attention, the city manager, Jim Twombly, has made the decision to search for new leadership of APD. That coming directly from that news release. Part of a statement from the city manager then goes on to read, to provide the level of public safety that our community deserves, a change in leadership must occur. And that change in leadership is effective immediately. That news release does not use the words retired or fired, but it does say effective immediately. Police Chief Vanessa Wilson is no longer the police chief there, that the a division chief will be taking over the reins of the Aurora Police Department. Now, one thing that was noted also in that news release, this is not going to affect the consent decree, the agreed to legal uh, agreement that major changes in APD will take place. Now, a news conference is scheduled for 11 a.m. this morning. We will be there and we will bring that to you live as soon as it happens. Now, Denver 7 first reported that the chief was on her way out, being forced out back on March 23rd. Now, since then, city leaders were silent about that until this morning. This also comes just one day after Denver 7 reported a major backlog of cases in APD's records division. That means that many cases, more than 2,500, went without a detective or without an investigation, some of them serious crimes like murders, for months. Now, again, just to recap, Aurora Police Chief Vanessa Wilson is out. This is effective immediately. This was a decision that was made by the Aurora City Manager. We got a statement. We are working on a news story to go up right now on the DenverChannel.com, and we will bring you that live news conference as soon as it happens at 11 a.m.